do with Mithra, you always want to end in up B. Because if you add another bear or another fair, you're just getting like five or six more percent. But when yeah. you end with an up B, you get 14%. That's your big ender. And it's guaranteed to be safe on hit, for sure. Yeah. Like, you're not going to get hit for going for it. Okay. Got a landing situation yeah, here. Land landing is obviously the hard part of the matchup. Oh, rolls, rolls into the up smash. Yep, up that'll do it. Smash. Questionable choice from Olive here, but you know what? He's the one who's in top four right now. I'll that be out of shield. Wow, into the On the exact platform, this corner. character's so light, it almost did kill. Gets grabbed into an ice. That parachute's really been going for these hammers. I yeah, mean, we've why seen not, lots of hammers, right? And most of them have ended in eight. <laughs> yeah. Oh, drop shield Pokes early. Him. Yeah, maybe that was supposed to be like an up out of shield to get the kill this time. Super patient landing. Just like, just, you know. Just drifting. Yeah, just out, drifted out, along. Out you're vibing, drifted along really. on the parachute. That's Mary why, Poppins it up. That's why his name is Parachute. It's all about the vibes. Oh, yeah, 100%. He's just skydiving out here. Having a great time. So much stuff is going to like Even Gentleman kills at this point for Myth or, or Pyra. So. Yep. Oh, okay. Air dodge. Counter hit up air. No. Okay. Don't jump Come into on. that. Yeah, we are, <laughs> you already made that mistake once. Don't do it again, please. That's a true combo. Let's go. Small little percent. Yep. Pyra combos, baby. She's got throw into one hit of her sword. Looks Tries to go for the footstool there. Misses it. it. No, -uh. almost. Oh, okay, Hit, hits the bomb just in time and doesn't die. Yeah, this is, Olive has done a really good job of slowing things down on this second stock. A lot of percent was built up early, but you know, hung on to the stock and now is getting to play this spacing game with Pyro. Uh, I'll bear, that'll do Jeez. it. Jeez. That'll do it. Switch to Mithra, go into low, percent, low percentage mode again. Get up attack, dash the attack, bomb, but dash attack, attack kills. Okay, sure. Yeah, that's all because the bomb extends, you know, the hitbox of the get up attack. Oh, so two. You have extra frames Go for punch. the up B. Yup. He's living. Ooh, Ooh he makes it up. Dodge. Nice air dodge. Makes it back to ledge. Just jumps in full hop nair. Let's let it rip. He's here to press buttons. Damn it. Yep. He's been doing that a lot though. For just immediate neutral get up up B. Dude, these roll in. Up B out of shield, yeah. up air. Olive is just rolling in past the sword and then up B. Misses the combo. I don't know if that one actually combos at 30% on a character's life. Yeah, it didn't watch. look like it. Ooh, stubby grab range. Whoa, looks for a blazing end. Dude, this is a tie this is game real now. close, really close. Yeah, and see, even when you're in Pyra, you know, so many other characters get to abuse the switch to Pyra. Ooh, just catches the Game jump in with the up smash doesn't. on shield. Game & Watch has to, like, do these super slow approach options, and Pyra's just still so comfortable. Yep. I just like so much more range once again. It's just like Game & Watch trying to challenge with these stubby options yeah. and like jumping in your face and just getting smacked with up smash out of shield. Try just to just jump like, at me. Try to jump at yeah. me. See what happens. All right. All right. Yeah, we're running it back. Game two. Game two. Olive with a nice start to the set. Back onto the PS2. No. War never changes. Yes. Yeah. You, and you know that you know, Parachute's looking for that full hop, that short hop uh, Nair to get the damage started. Okay, so there's, is it gonna be hammer? there's the cam he combo start. He doesn't look for the hammer this time. He goes Nairs Just instead. Just takes his damage, yep. Whoa, low percent Pyra coming out. I mean, she is really, really good in the game watch. Look at that. Just Nairs right through two sausages and then still connects onto mm -hmm. game watch. Ooh, no. Is that gonna be a kill? No, no not quite. Ooh, Almost caught that landing, it, too, yeah. and that could have been a kill. And Olive, again, has spent basically this entire game so far on the Pyra. <laughs> that looks like it's just going to body Game & Watch every time, and then he goes nowhere. That move is crazy good. Yeah. So many people don't know to, like, challenge it when it's at its height after the first hit goes off. Mm -hmm. So even if you don't connect, you can get away with it a lot of the time. Good DI from Parachute. 
Uh-oh, no sword. Got to run away. Oh, okay, yep. Just in there. can't just challenge it. it. You, you just got to be careful about what you challenge when you're gaming watch here, you know? This time, though, Olive actually opting to switch to the Mithra for a bit. I wonder if this will last. Back to Pyra. Dude. That's so crazy that it just beats Sausage. That's yeah. such a good way to recover right to the stage. Yeah, I mean, you can't, you have to, like, wait when you're Game & Watch. You can't just immediately set up Sausage on the ledge. You have to respect it. Oh, doesn't connect with the down smash for the neutral get up there. Just times the uh, invincibility as well. What? That took forever to come out. Yeah, lots of uh, clinks done. Oh, are you living? Both on edge. Nope. Up B is going to score the kill. That was interesting. Okay, catches the jump. Yeah, big start into an up air too. Whoa, oh, tries for the air, air dodge, dodge, but nothing there. Yeah, that was such a good, you know, patience and read on the air dodge, but then just didn't capitalize, unfortunately. Dude, stacking it up. Yeah, lots of damage coming out here for Parachute. Parachute. Reties yeah, the game. Gets one sausage, one sausage and just bails. Yeah, bails with the up B. That's unfortunate. He could have comboed into Lion Tamer off of that, I think. No. Oh, is that, okay. Nope. Okay, air dodge is smartly away and goes back to the ledge. Oh, back air. Yep, that'll do Dude. it. Dude. This sword, how do you deal with it as Game & Watch? Tough. It's tough, so yeah, hard. it's real tough. Hey, that's a grab. Not, not going to be any guaranteed damage off of that, though. Oh, misses the follow-up there. Oh, we can down spot. smash, yep. Oh, do it again. Oh, he lets him back. Yep. Uh, yeah, interesting. Not interesting sure option to challenge was, the recovery. Yeah. Olive kind of running away with it. Okay, that'll do it. Yep, parry into down tilt. Nice. Even yeah. catches the cross up to go in front of him. Yeah, that's a very rare move to see come out of Game & Watch in this game. It was yeah. a much better move in Smash 4. Oh, the, yeah. The lid reached so much further. And the win box yeah, had a win box, box too, on it. Yeah. That move was fun. Now it's just kind of weird. This is like, you just don't really see it. Yeah, now ever. he just like leans and it's like very short range. It's like... They did so much, put so much love into the animations on like moves like that, and like his yeah. up tilt, and like some other moves that you just never use them. If anyone watching is like, "Hey, why the heck are these guys talking about Smash Four? That game's six years old." We We're old. We had a Smash Four tournament here at Smart Coast Four. Okay. Yeah. So we it's did. fresh in our minds. We did. It's fresh in our minds. Also, we're old. <laughs> okay, we are really looking for the up smash here. I, yeah, and again, I just want to emphasize how much of this game has been spent on the Pyra. Yeah, no, it, almost the entire thing. Like, literally, maybe, like, five seconds of Mithra for some low percent combo, and then you switch to Pyra just immediately. Dude, it's so hard. Oh, he's just almost catching these roll-ins. Parachute with a little bit of a lead here, but he's just made of paper. I mean, like, two good hits. You could just easily take it. That back air, and then maybe, like, one more. Another one. Staling it, at least, so he's going to live that move a bit longer. Just yeah, and I then grab it. like all the pressure out from the shield. The yep. Yeah. No, dead heat, even game. Uppy. Both of these characters should be thinking. Ooh, okay, gets hit right with now. the full bomb. Hasn't really been able to char yeah, challenge that's the. Do it. Yeah, I'll do it. There's the Has upbeat. Hasn't really been able to challenge the recoveries very effectively no. from uh, Pyra. Yeah, you've got to do this kind of. Okay, she's going to fade in and transform, and that transform is going to serve as an air dodge, and they still have yep. another air dodge to work with. So you kind of just have to wait out these options. And then actually what you, what I think you should be looking for is punishing them as they fade under the ledge after the transform. Mm -hmm. Maybe look for like a stage spike type of thing, you know? For sure. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's like Pokemon Trainer in a way. It's like yeah. with the Switch, like, is punishable in it, in and of itself. So yeah. you got to be looking for that. The when only difference is that with, like, the Pyramithra Switch, they keep momentum, you know? So yes. you got you to, like, make sure you're tracking them well. Yes, 100%. Trying okay. to catch these jumps, but okay. Oh, whew. Get some off stage. I'm expecting a swap. Yep. Okay, here we go. Low percent combo. Oh, only gets one hit of the nair. Yeah, you got to full hop that nair when you're underneath the platform. That's that. That's the macro coming in, the short hop macro. Yeah, true. But here we go. Okay, here we go. Yeah, parachute picks use it up anyway. Use the key. Anyway. Yeah, use the key. Instead of going down there and potentially getting counter hit, use the key. You, you can just challenge it. Wow, she got to nuh-uh out of up the up air. Yeah. 
character's whack. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm loving these down airs from uh, Parachute here. Yeah, that's a tool we hadn't seen a whole lot of in uh, the first two games. Okay, no, yeah, that's not going to combo into anything. Okay, down. Uh, dash attack, get him off stage. Hell. She's going to up you yeah, know. Still, trying to still trying to figure out this recovery just a little bit here. Oh, that's shield break. No way. Flame Nova charges the neutral B. All right, Mithra comes out for a second here. And, and there goes Mithra. Yeah. Are we going to see the switch? Nope. He's going to stay for this low percent combo. Try to get one combo and then maybe switch. Get Game of Watch off stage. Going to get comboed herself. Yeah, so far. You know, I haven't actually been paying attention to Olive's percent. I wonder if rather than the enemy's percent, which is what a lot of people usually decide Ooh. when they go Pyramithra off of, if Olive's basing it off of his own percent. Because hmm. he's like, I can uh, Future Sight or whatever the hell that's called that Mithra does to get out of these combos when I'm at low percent from Game & Watch, and then I can switch to the Pyra. And it's like, I don't have to worry about Nairs anymore. And as well, like, when you're getting knocked off stage, like, I feel like he definitely wants to be Pyro when he's getting knocked off stage. Uh, Parachute's had a lot more success edge guarding Mithra yeah. as opposed to Pyra. The percent is building up, though. We're looking for a Lion Tamer. Doesn't kill quite yeah, yet. Not, not quite there yet. Oh, able to get back to the ledge. Doesn't jump into the turtle. No, oh, that's Okay, death. that's, yep, you're dead, unfortunately. Great. Unfortunate Photon Edge coming out when yeah. he didn't need it. Good choice on the bomb, because no other Game & Watch aerial is killing there. Yeah. Stack it up. Okay, switches into the Mithra to get it down, and then, yeah. All right, stuck in the corner here. Oh, nice parry. Going to get a grab out of that. Nothing there, hammer, though. Nice so hammer. Nice hammer. some food. I feel, like, uh, I feel like Parachute's getting the short hop macro a lot uh -huh. here. Yeah, I tried to get these full hop nares instead of short hop nares. Mm -hmm. Hey, yep, down, uh, down, to, down throw. Okay, that should be it. Yep. Wow, All right, parachute does parachute take a game. On the board, yeah. I mean, every game thus far has happened on PS2, and I gotta imagine that there are better levels for Olive to be counter picking to. Oh yeah. Specifically, you know, Town and City and Smashville because she's killing off the side so much with forward airs and yep. forward tilts and stuff like that. Mm hmm. Kellos. Kellos. Okay. Interesting. High ceiling. You're not going to die to those up smashes as early, but there's there's something devious happening yeah, here. Yeah, I don't. I, I don't like it. I don't I, know what like walls really do for Pyramithra. Maybe it's something about like the higher platforms on the sides. You can get early upbeat kills. I don't know. I'm, I I'm guess not, we'll have to. I'm not sure on the counter pick choice. I guess we'll have to see here. For the most part, it's just FD. You know, as far as neutral goes, but it's it's just going to change up once we come to those uh, those edge guards. Dude, four down tilts in a row. Just, yep. Just press it. It's such a good button. Why not? Yeah. I mean, it's just such like a – it's so fast. So and fast, it's just like yeah. your prototypical combo down tilt. It just starts so much pressure off of it. Yep. Nope. I'm done here. I'm leaving. Yep. Drop shield on the nair. Oh, and now, now he's got full control. Hit by a pyra yeah. hit. I'm wondering if it has something to do with the the, the edge guarding as well. <sighs> okay, able to air dodge down, Ooh, misses the for punish. A dash attack. Dash attack would have blown Game and Watch up at this percent, though. I like the choice. Rather than looking for like a forward tilt that's just gonna like recycle the edge guard. Yeah. Okay. Can't land there. No fly zone. Yeah. The platform actually kind of giving parachute like a false sense of security. He was like, oh, I don't want to go low. Let me take this plat, and then he still gets blown Ooh, up. Ooh. Okay. Good drift there from Olive, mixing it up. Aggressive there from ledge. Yep. Gets off the ledge. Goes back to Pyra. Okay, nice. Bombs the platform. Okay, what's the option from ledge? Looking for jumps. Just take a center stage. I like that. Get out of there. If you don't have sausage set up in time, then who cares? I'm gone. Yeah, for sure. Um, I'm liking the Kalos counter pick uh, for the sake of uh, Olive's recoveries. Just like gives him a little nice little safe haven to go to against Game of Watch. Get out of the corner pressure. Yeah, and now. Uh, parachute looking for parries on the repeated down tilts coming out from Olive. Yep. And even if you do parry that, like you got to be on point with your punish because that's that's so fast. Like you might be able to get an up B, maybe. Ooh, Ooh just gets DI clipped and bad DI. This is even a high ceiling stage in that kill because he was holding in. Yep. 
Olive running away with game four. Yep. Look to wrap up the set. Just gonna build more damage. Yep, switch to Pyra. Just get the big damage going, get the big range. And worth mentioning that before this top eight started, Olive had a really good set with um, Moose. Uh, that mm -hmm. like the Lucas was looking really clean. Won the first couple, won the first game, and then Moose switches to uh, Inkling and yeah. actually almost took a game. Was doing two. pretty well, yeah. So Olive on a bit of a run right now. Yeah, and uh, looking to move into uh, losers finals here. What sausage? Yep, yeah, no, I don't care about that. See, oh, see, that's where you get killed. That, that's a bad part of this stage as a counter pick. And I, I know that, especially as a Krom player. Like, I'm never allowed to up be high, and yeah. obviously Pyrus suffers from the same thing. Yeah, you're just going to end up dying. It land on the platform, it's a free punish. But still, massive lead here for Olive. Uh, Parachute's got to find something quick here. And the hammer, I mean, that would do it, but yeah. you gotta, you gotta look for it in the right situation. The one just puts more damage on himself, though. Yep. No jump, still no jump. It's dead. dead. That's death. Yeah. Okay. Wow. All right. Well, that's Evens something for up. sure. But eighty-five percent. Don't count parachute out too early. Down yeah, I don't like the decision to go high there on the against the invincibility. Like you're just gonna have so much trouble landing versus up air. Like. Whoa. Okay, kind of dancing around here. Getting yep. Real creative. Back air. Oh, living. Hit Goes out super deep. Game and watch him go so deep, though. He doesn't care. Gets to center so stage. So alive at he 125. He has an opportunity. You find a nair, and you get your early 40%, and you're back in this. There's something, yep. Undo an up air. Yes. Early 30, early 40. We're going. Another. Okay. Another. Now, now Mithra's up. out. Oh, okay, nope, he... never mind. Anything's going to do it. Gets past at the ledge. Do it. Yep. Wait it out. Wait, wait it out. All right, we have seen Olive look for a lot of jump from ledges. No, and that'll do it. Up yep. Into the blazing end, and that's going to be it. Olive moving on. Parachute.